a new version of Photoshop 2021, uh, we now have a new learn uh, app window. So uh, this is a very great uh, way to learn Photoshop, and especially for some uh, basic uh, concept. So let's get started to um, walk through some of those uh, tutorials to learn more about how to use those tutorials and that at the same time, we're going to learn more deeply about Photoshop operations. So um, when you open Learn um, tab here on the first window, but you can also go to Help and then go uh, using um, these hands-on uh, tutorials. So let's go to go uh, to know the app. So to this new Discover window show how you can quickly start the tutorials without download any files. Let's begin to click this blue button. Now you have this file with uh, with some informations um, and also uh, with all the necessary information. Just assuming that you are a new beginner, so you just need to follow uh, where to find those information. And if you want to learn more, uh, that's uh, additional information there. So we try to just go uh, very quickly and um, go introduce some of the information uh, with directly, uh, so you can show the whole workflow. Um, when you can combine with this interactive version with our video version to learn more about those information. So. And um, so let's click next. So the basically the first one to introduce where is the layers and the layers panel. And then we're going to drag uh, the full flower layer above the woman layer. Okay, so this request, we move this one to the top. So this is a basic uh, operation uh, as we usually do to arrange layers. Layers you should really just uh, think about is a piece of uh, a few pieces of papers uh, with the transparent background, and then you can put them together. Okay, and then click next. So, and then click the eye. I would say was request is click the eye icon to the left of woman layer to turn the layer off. Okay, and then click next. So you see the interaction model here um, is very intuitive. The toolbar is one of the most important part of the interface. So um, this is gonna to um, click next to introduce the, some basic information. And you wanna select zoom here, the shortcut is Z, okay? Um, and then you can zoom and then click next. Using eyedropper, you can simple color. I think they wanted to drop her um, the orange color here. So you get this one as front color. Click next. And the double click the hand to fit the image on screen. So that's a, a quick way to fit the image. Uh, also, you can use command zero to do the same thing. Click next. Uh, access to option in the option bar. So let's have a several uh, option bars here. Okay. Okay. So this, since this is just a basic information, um, so sometimes they just show the information and ask you to click um, and then go to the next. Okay. So uh, select the brush to and open the brush pre preset. Okay. Try the size. Avenger. Or normally did to this low. Okay. This is really designed for beginners. You may find this this is very slow actually. Um, process. Create a new layer by selecting the plus sign. Okay. Um, press the center of the orange. All right, and click the box. Okay. 
Where's this guy? Okay, spot the hitting brush. Click open the brush preset. Okay, enter. Um, there are one additional thing you can do is the when you change the size, you want to change the size to, um, you know, you can just click the, the text itself. You don't have to direct, grab this bar. Uh, sometimes we found this one give you more um, accurate control so you can more easily get the number you want. Okay, um, and we got this one 100% and uh, 100 pixels and then click next. Drag over the two birds. Uh, okay, so well, basically you want to remove the two birds. Okay, so let's try that. Um, the hitting brush is do the job. So just remove the things um, with some uh, calculating the pixels. So you, so it's quickly remove that uh, object only. Okay, click next. Click next. Okay, I think I've done the job. It's uh, it's a uh, well, I would say it's a quite a long process, um, but if, if you are a truly beginner, uh, you will get some new concept of this. Um, I think it's it's a quite helpful to uh, experience uh, Photoshop in this way because they they will um, give you more information um, on particular tools. Um, with repeat or emphasize those information will help you to uh, build a. A knowledge, more knowledge of Photoshop.